What is going on, my dudes? Welcome back to another video, guys. Today we have for you guys Mr. Kurzawa team or not team of the week, but moments player. I'm not really sure what he got a moments for, to be honest. But regardless, guys, the car looks really good, boys. He is 60, so he's six foot tall. But the, the bad part about this car is he's medium low, so I'm not really sure how he's gonna play inside the game. So let's go ahead and get into the game. I'll let you guys know how he is. I love the four star skill, three star weak foot is also really good. He's tall, he's got good stats, and he has good, uh, like, physical and defending, which is decent. 71 uh, strength may not be enough, but let's see how it goes. Uh, if you guys enjoyed this video, guys, hit the like, sub to the channel, comment down below. Let me know if you guys are going to get him. Um, for me, I'm going to get him on my RTG because I need a left back who's actually a little bit pacer than Kamara. But let's see how he compares to Kamara. All right, guys, team we're going to be playing is this team right here. It looks very sweaty. Foot Champions is the name, so he's Foot Champions. Ready? All right, guys, first things first. Pace is there. Really, really good dribbling, guys. Oh, wow, his dribbling is actually fantastic. I like it a lot more than um than Mendy's dribbling already. Just off of the start. Yeah, his dribbling is awesome, boys. L1 dribbling, moving it backwards is really good, too. Making that run. Good pass. Didn't score that, but that was very, very good pass, man. He wasn't able to catch up right there, but he is able to, like, catch up and get the ball back. Honestly, I thought he did an okay job of trying to get the ball back right there, guys. Man, his dribbling, his pace is decent, man. I really like his height, guys, because, like, a lot of fullbacks are kind of short most of the time. So, they aren't able to get those balls right there. Kurzawa does go to the middle of the field and is able to get that right there. He is moving into the mid, into like the middle of the field a lot more than I would, what I would like him to. But for the most part, he is getting, he is being productive and getting the ball back at least. Guys, I couldn't find a game. So I went into a, uh, into a 40 millisecond game with a four bar. So I'm hoping that's not going to like be terrible gameplay. But let's see how he feels in this gameplay, guys. He was it? Oh man! All right, boys, we did get a penalty. We're gonna give it to Kurosawa and see how he does here. Oh, he went the right way, boys. All right, right there, guys. You saw Kurosawa push up quite a lot, man. Quite a lot, boys. Nice little tackle right there. Was able to catch up perfectly. Let's see, will he catch up right here? Doesn't get the chance to. He would have caught up there, which is good. I think the only player he hasn't been able to outpace is Neymar. Still making that run. Nice. Come on. Oh, my God. Oh, that would have been such a beautiful pass, man. All right, my dude. So, Kurzawa play review, guys. I am going to say, boys, first off, if you guys do this car, just be aware that the medium low work rates will probably put a little bit of an effect into the game, right? Uh, we played two games with him one of the games the guy quit as soon as like we got into the game the second the first game we got a rage quit and the second game ended up 4-4 <clears throat> now what i took away from both both from both of those games were that he is a good left back he really is but i still would rather use mendy at left back if it was up to me as a you know french uh left back now if you need a player to really uh, you know, give name or a link or an extra link, etc. This is the perfect card for you guys. Um, over Kamara, I definitely would pick Kurzawa over Kamara personally, right? Um, after playing two games with him, I did like him. I think he's decent. He's not necessarily the best player out there, but he is good. He's better than Kamara. And um, I mean, personally, like I just think that the link to Neymar is perfect, right? And he also links to Mbappe as well. So six foot feels really good on the ball medium low will be an issue for some people um i did notice that he moved up to the midfield quite a lot and he would leave that left back space open quite a bit so that was an issue for me but other than that like it was really good four star skill moves is nice three star weak foot's great um pace wise guys i definitely do recommend that you guys use a shadow on this card i was using an anchor and he is quick but he does not feel extremely fast guys that sprint speed needs to be faster uh catching up to players like mbappe 
it's literally impossible but he will catch up to everyone else that has like a probably 90 pace 92 93 he'll he'll catch up to them um it's just catching up to like the really high tier meta players is probably going to be an issue for him um his shooting wise he has really good shooting so if you do get inside the box you do have a chance to shoot with him from outside the box this guy will actually shoot and do good with that we didn't have any chances like that as i had him as he i didn't want him to push up too much with the medium low right now going into the passing the passing was really good uh can't complain at all we did one long pass over to lucas mora and it was a fantastic pass with a through ball so overall the passing felt great dribbling wise guys i think this is where the card really shines i think that dribbling was my favorite part about the card even though this card is six foot um he feels great guys personally i would rather use this card over Mendy, if we were talking about dribbling over Kamara, the dribbling on this card is actually amazing. I love how tall he is because he's able to get those headers. Uh, and sometimes something that Kamara can't do. Mendy is able to do that, but Kamara cannot in the league on defending and physical felt good, guys. I can't really I can't really say anything bad about it. Um, I would say maybe a little bit more strength on the card would be great. So if you turn it down from a from an anchor to a shadow, you do lose that 10 plus strength. But I do think it's worth it to get that speed to be able to catch up to more players. Um but overall, man, he's a nice card. I definitely would recommend getting him if you need a Neymar link, if you need an Mbappe link, if you want uh, to, you know, replace Kamada, if you want to replace someone on the left back side. I personally really like to use Bendy at center back on my road to glory. So I will be selling my Kamara and doing Kurzawa on the RTG for this card. Um, as well, he gives the link to, name, uh, to Neymar. So that's literally the perfect thing for me to do, right? Um, other than that, guys, solid card. I I'll give the card like an 8.5 out of 10. Um, and that's bringing him to Mendy. If I'm comparing him to Kamara, I'll give him a 9, a nine out of 10. Um, Kamara is decent, but he's nowhere near as good as Kurzawa. And he's short. Kurzawa's tall, so definitely would rather go him. Um, but yeah, man, that's going to be the video, guys. If you guys do enjoy it, make sure you guys hit the like button on the video. Sub to the channel. Comment down below. Let me know if you guys are doing him. Um, I will be doing him on the Road to Glory. And yeah, boys, I will see you guys on the next video. Thank you guys for watching. Have a good day.